Hello there and welcome to Farming Simulator 2013 with me, Stockel Gloss. How are you? Uh, let's start our, continue our career, not start a career. Uh, I'd like to apologise in my previous episode. Um, I don't know what I'd done. I managed to put some old footage in from epo episode 26 to 27. Um, I know a lot of you worked that out already. It's only about three or four minutes, so um, <laughs> my apologies for that. Uh, just trying to get back to normal after having a bit of a break. Um, so, yes, I've done a little bit off screen, not too much actually. I think I only spent about 10 15 minutes, um, and the grass has seemed to have grown a lot quicker this time uh, than it did last time. So, we're back. Um, the silage has actually turned well, it's actually turned to silage now, the grass. So, we should be feeding our cows this episode. Okay, let's start. Auction for field 13. Oh yeah, also, um, I'd like to thank Sean from Las Vegas, uh, you know who you are. Um, Adutes, uh, the, it's got an like, inspector mo uh, mod, uh, I've installed that. I know uh, some of you, other people have left comments about the inspector mod as well. Uh, so I'd like to thank you all for that. Okay, you're full. And there's our silage. Uh, don't look much, but uh, we'll come to that in a second. Where are you? There you are. Oh, also, guys, um, check this out. Yes, I've managed to get this connected, and it works a treat. So uh, instead of having the sh the, uh, the sprayer getting stuck on all the trees. Look at this beautifully sown, fertilised uh, field. If you get this little, this t it's like £9,000, the little um, fertiliser. It's great to see it in action. It works a treat. Um, I can't believe I haven't done this before. Uh, I'll show you on this field up here. And the inspector mod is pretty cool because it tells you what, if you're wondering what attachments I've got, you know, connected to the tractor, or what tractor I'm in, and it, it all tells you all the information you need to know. But to set this thing up is uh, fairly easy. Okay, something like that. We are on canola. So we've just got like that. Change to the front attachment. Turn it on. Change to the back attachment. Hire the worker. Check that out. Hey. Eh? I am so proud of myself. <laughs> I haven't seen any videos. This is God's honest truth. I haven't seen any videos anybody do this before. Um, and it just works amazingly well. So, so yeah. I take full responsibility for that. Hang on, I'll just move this quickly. Otherwise, Zachary's going to go right in the back of him. It's impossible to reverse. Oh, hang on. There we go, so and load in. Uh, it's impossible to reverse with these um this double duo thingy. But look at that go, eh? Oh, it's brilliant. <laughs> I'm so pleased with myself. And as you can see with the inspector mod, you can see uh the percentage going down as we unload the uh, the harvester into the trailer. So Zachary's going to make short work of this field. Let's hire you in then. Sorry for all the tabbing. Let's get him down here.
but really, you know, um, spraying was the only thing you actually do manually. We really automated the whole thing now. Isn't that great? Fantastic. Okay. Right now for this thing. Now we need um, silage. Only silage in our in our cow tr truff, uh, truff, whatever it's called. Um, statistics. So, oh, so we're starting to produce manure. So we got feeding trough, uh, gla grass. We need silage and then mixed rations. So we'll do the silage first. So basically, all we need to do is just suck up the silage with this thing. Turn on the mixer, I guess. There we go. So say, uh, oh, we must have filled it up. We've got plenty of. Uh, there we go. So we have got that's that's only silage. And then what we do is we fill this up. Here. Oh my god, don't get stuck. Don't get. Oh, look at. Ah, there we go. Perfect. So we'll unload that. Q. And you can see the, uh, the soil is pouring out into the trough. So they've got silage, they've got grass, now they need uh, the mixed ration. So to do that, I'll just park it here. I'll just move you in onto the other field. Uh, the good thing is as well, um, with the the fertilizer there it doesn't cost that much and the usage gets taken out of uh, the wages so you only have to fill it up a little bit the same as a cedar and it doesn't run out as well you know obviously if you do it yourself it will run out but with a worker it takes it into uh, consideration with the wages right Start you and off. Go. Move you out the way. So we need one hay, one straw, a little bit of silage, and we'll see how much that gives us. Um, this is the hardest bit about it, I think. Maybe I've got the wrong attachment, maybe it's not a pallet fork I need, maybe I need a proper bale fork. Shut up, guys. Um, no, it's that way. Um,
Yes. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. Uh, there we go. So that's one shore. And. This is one hay. I think that might fall off. I can hear the cows chomping behind me. Brilliant. So we've got one hay, one straw. Let's go get some silage. So we need. Actually, that work out one one one. It's not too bad. Fifty percent hay, fifty percent straw. We should have enough for silage here. So let's turn on the mixer. Turn it off. There we go. Oh no, we haven't got no straw. Hopefully that will work out as a uh, mixed ration. We hope. Really, cows are so picky. Right. Hopefully this is mixed ration coming out. Yes, it is. As you can see, it's... Uh, filling it there nicely. We are now proper milk farmers. So they've got plenty of mixed rations, plenty of silage, bit of grass, bit of straw, happy days. We've got 18 litres of milk. So what we can do now is we've got 33,000, we can buy more cows. At two grand each, we've only got two. Um, how much is that? 15 cows. Can we go 20? No. 18 cows. Well, there you go, guys. That is how we get to 100% productivity on uh, milk. So you just got to keep an eye on that. And. <laughs> Alright, Zachary's finished. Let's get it ready on this field. So, uh, thumbs up, like, if you like the idea of what I've done here. <laughs> I was so impressed with myself. I even told the wife, I said, uh, oh, come check this out, look what I've just done. Yeah, she didn't care. She went, oh, that's lovely. <laughs> She's got no idea. Alright, we're a bit short of money now. Um, what have we got in our solos? Uh, looking in the wrong place. Wrong place. Wool. Up to 100% again. Alright, we need to empty that. Actually, we could do that now. We've probably finished with this for the cows for just a minute. So I'll take this down to the... Um, let's get that down there. So we're going to take this over to the sheep. I'm going to try and upload this in 1080p. If it's not in 1080p then it failed. If it is, then happy days. Um, some of the guys on Facebook have uh, 
been giving me a hand. So uh, I'd like to thank him for that on how to uh, upgrade this to 1080p. to get dark. I think we need to cross here. Let me move this out of the way. We all know the way now. I am getting used to this map very slowly. And what we can do is actually go to the uh, shop and buy ourselves a trailer. But I've got no money. Quick tractor. Uh, somebody mentioned in the comments about stacking the sh uh, the sheep pallets into a triangle. Um, if you guys see me use this front loader, it, it, it isn't going to happen. So we got four there. So we got five. Probably wait for one more and then um, we'll get a trailer and sell it. Right, I'm not brave enough to do this in uh, first person, so. Oh, that was nearly perfect. Hergenstead, happy sheep. Hey, I'm getting cocky now. Lovely. So we've got all this money. I don't know what to do with it. Uh, not all this money. All this wool. Right, we need to unload you in. He's at 82%. I tell you what, that, that inspector's really handy. start Zachary off yet, just yet, because uh, he moves a little bit quicker than the combine. Let's have a look at the fields, how the fields are doing. Well, we've got some grass to grow, and as you can see the fields are progressing nicely. It's like a, as we're finished with this one, then this one starts to, so I quite like the way it's, uh, it's working at the moment, especially with that attachment. I don't know if I've mentioned about the attachment yet, <laughs> the, uh, the fertilizer, I don't know if I mentioned it. Right. Well, we need new gold, guys, because we've got we've done our milk production. Um, that didn't work. And we need money. We'll wait till the harvest is done, and we we we'll look at. Uh, Hopefully getting a great demand or selling our harvest. I'll put this put that there ready for him for next time in his next pass. Uh, 
was starting off now. I'm sticking with canola for the time being. Turn that on. Play a worker. Off he goes. Oh, I love it. It does cost quite a bit of money. As you can see, the money going down fairly quickly. <laughs> but it's worth it in the end. If we could have a look at our, uh, how much it's, our costs, as it were. Uh, other. We should be making a lot of money of milk. Where's our milk? Statistics. Eighteen litres. I don't know why we're not showing a hundred percent on productivity yet. We should be soon. But isn't that great? Isn't that amazing? In fact, it's so amazing. We could probably go to sell our big sprayer because uh, it's not like we're going to need it again. Let's go back to the farm. I think the H means hide worker. You know the way it says, um, the, I don't know how to pronounce it, Bureau. A plus a Porsche Ponto 9 DC plus E Amazon ZAX I think this will be the next one we buy this this field here hang on this is one that we own we already own this one I'm on about oh yeah we need to unload you in he's not gonna make it unfortunately I uh, got the power. Um. So let's go sell that big sprayer, which is a big pain in the bum. Uh, a few people. Uh, a little. I'll start that again. A few people have asked me to change my intro, but um, when I have changed it in the past, uh, a lot of people don't like it that I've changed it. They're saying, "Oh, we want it back." So I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what to do. I don't mind changing it, but obviously, if people like the intro, and I'll keep it. It's a. Uh, it's a nightmare because if I do do it, then it will upset somebody. If I don't do it, you know, I, I'll upset somebody. So, uh, I don't know. How many cows does um, a dairy farmer normally have? Because we've got 18. Is that enough? Do we need more? I don't know. I wouldn't know how many... To be a successful dairy farmer... I am glad to get rid of this thing though. Let's just uh, get out of there and sell it. Yes, please. Now we've got 29 bucks. And while we're here, I might as well pick up a. a. Doo -doo -doo. Oh, what's on sale? Extra weight. No, we don't want any of that. Not tractor. We want 
I can't think of it now. When I see it, I know it. There we go, the bell trailer. So we bought that, so we can put all our uh, wool on it. We can start storing our wool on the trailer, ready for selling. I might buy a few more cows as well. I think I'm going to go uh, a bit mad on the cows. Mad cow! Hey! There's another one of my crazy jokes. There we go. That'll be enough for the moment. But I'm going to keep increasing that. Until we've got milk coming out of our ears. Whoa! Oh, just cut him in half. So let's head back to our uh, sheep headquarters. Oh, it's a bit erratic driving in the front seat of this. Oh, I need to make sure Ewan's okay. Oh, that thing just works amazingly, doesn't it? Works a treat. Doesn't matter whether there's trees around or not, it'll work. Beautiful. I don't know why I'm unloading him, because we're only planting canola at the moment, so it doesn't really make a difference. Right, let's take it back to the farm. Reset, reset him. Take too long. Where is he? Uh, harvesters. There we go. So they've got the front attachment as well. Yeah, it's got it all. No. It hasn't got it all. Tools, trailers. Yes, we want to reset that one. Jobs are good. Let's carry on with our mission to go see the uh, sheep. Oh, could you imagine loading all the bales on, on this trailer? Can't imagine anything worse. I shouldn't really go across the field, I know. But yeah, this is the field I might get next. It's a nice sized field. A bit weird because it's owl shaped, but we can deal with that. line this up. I'll turn around first. Oh, this is going to take a while. Right, 
Right, this can either go really smoothly or really, really bad. Um, let's lower that. Not too bad. So far, so good. I'm not worried about how pretty it looks on the trailer. That don't bother me. Just get it on there. Yeah, I've gone a bit quiet because I'm concentrating. <laughs> um. I think I'm going to struggle to get five on here, to be honest. Ooh. Just lower. Come back. Back a little bit. Lower. Yes. That's how we roll. Can you hear those sheep eating? Right. <laughs> oh, I was doing so well. Ugh. Let's see if we can put these on the other side then. Oh, I didn't give myself a good chance of. Don't you dare. Try and reverse up the hill. I don't recommend it doing this at home. It's not the most ideal way of stacking a. Okay, that I'm reversing. I'm not going forwards. I'm reversing. Come on. Oh, this is where it goes wrong. Oh my god. Reverse! Go on, reverse! Oh no! Stop it! Okay. I need to move the trailer. I don't know why I didn't do this in the first place. Should give me enough space. Oh. Very unstable when you carry loads like this, so I wouldn't recommend it. Reverse, don't go forward. Okay. Guys, I read this is really interesting for you. Uh stop. Lower. Lower. Reverse, reverse, reverse. Go on. Come on. 
Go on, reverse, don't go down. Uh, forwards. Lift it up a little bit. Forward. Down. Reverse. Reverse. No. Lift it up. No, wrong way. Wrong way. Lift it up. Reverse. Yes. Wow. Okay. Two more. Oh my god. What is wrong with this tractor? Yes, I am blaming the tractor. Oh, too low. I could do this quite easy, so I'm just going to turn the tractor around, I think. Instead of trying to pull it on the other side. Well, we should fit the last one on there quite... Easy. Yes. It don't look pretty, I know, but it does the job. Well, the money's still going down. I think our workers should have finished. Ah, my fault. I thought the worker was taking a bit long just to finish that field. <laughs> the brake lights come on the front of the uh, the fertilizer. That's quite funny. Okay, let's go back to business. I'll try and put this one in the middle there for stability. Beautiful. Look at that. Absolutely spot on ish. Apart from that one on the other side, but that was kind of my fault, so I put the trailer in the wrong way, wrong position. And why can't I connect the trailer? Thank you. Right then, let's uh Let's go sell our wares. I'm going to take it fairly easy. Because if they come off, I only have to really put them back on again, so... Actually, they're quite stable. I thought they'd be a lot more bouncy than the... Uh, than they are. That's a good sight, isn't it? That's a better sight than than that. That looks lazy. That looks like we've been really busy. Right, we haven't done too much this episode, but we have got 100% milk production. Let's just check on our cows. Yes, we're at 100%. Yeah. We got 196 litres of milk in the tank. We've got loads of liquid manure. We're starting to uh, produce manure now. And there we go. It takes a bit of effort to get, get done and a bit of time with the silage and, and all that jazz, but I think it's worth it.
I'm going to keep bumping up the cows. Eventually try and get like a hundred cows or something. I think that's a proper dairy farmer. A hundred cows. All producing our milk. I think we're going to call it Stocko's Milk. <laughs> yeah. Okay, what have we got? Nine grand. 9,313. 9,313. Wow. That was a, a fairly nice payday. It's about 24 grand. Alright, I'll take this back to... Oh my god, what am I doing? Alright, I'll take this back to the sheep pen, but this is going to be the end of the episode. Uh, thank you for watching. My name's Stocker Gloss, and this is Farming Simulator 2013. Um, I'll see you all very soon. Ciao for now.